Good evening, everybody. How are you? It's good to be in the state of New York. You know, it's amazing. I got a letter from uh, a mother in my district. And that mother has a bipolar child who's schizophrenic. And she fears for her life and the lives of her neighbors every day. And the mental health system in the state of New York <clears throat> has failed her repeatedly. It's a kangaroo system where that child will be treated like a number, a ticking time bomb to go off. And that single mom doesn't have the support in this state or that system to care for that child. And tonight we preach about saving lives. Not long ago, I think a woman was in Georgia. She had several young children. Her husband showed her how to shoot. Somebody broke into her home, came after her. She shot him, I believe, six times. Tonight, we're going to pass legislation that if she had eight rounds in that chamber instead of seven, she'd be a criminal. We haven't saved any lives tonight, except for one, the political life of a governor who wants to be president. We haven't taken an entire category of firearms that are currently legal that are in the homes of law-abiding, tax-paying citizens. As a legislature that believes in its power, to the extent where you actually profess you're magically saving lives, we are now turning those law-abiding citizens into criminals. And tomorrow, hoping that on the front pages, we will be seen as preventing tragedies. Yet that single mom will wake up tomorrow with that bipolar child who's schizophrenic and violently and mentally ill, and we will have done nothing. Good night. And I voted no, and I only wish I could have done it twice. Thank you, Senator. Any senators wishing to explain their vote?